Hello everyone and welcome to my bold and beautiful today update channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Steffi plots to get Liam and Hope. The bold and the beautiful spoilers suggest that Steffi Forrester could compass to get Liam Spencer and Hope Logan back together. Of course, this would most probably have to do with how important it would help break some of her problems and not that she believes they belong together. The bold and the beautiful spoilers. Steffi Forrester needs Liam Spencer away. Let's be honest, ever since Liam saw Hope kiss Thomas Forrester in Rome, he has set his sights on her and has fully disrespected her marriage in the process. Liam has indeed gone as far as to kiss her, further than formerly, knowing she's a undermine woman. Steffi's marriage for months. Will Steffi make one like attempt to save Liam and Hope's marriage before those divorce papers are filed? After all, since Liam cannot grasp the conception that Steffi wants nothing to do with a reunion with him, can't Liam repair effects with his woman? Of course, that's if Steffi can find a way to come between Thomas Forrester and Hope as well. But PBB spoilers! Steffi Forrester's marriage is solid the bold and the beautiful spoilers reveal that Steffi and John Finn Finnegan have a solid marriage despite Liam and Sheila Carter's Kimberlyn Brown hindrance. Steffi has no interest in giving up the love of her life for a waffler like Liam. Liam has proven way too numerous times that he cannot he commit to one convinced woman that he can ultimately marry Steffi and have a life with her and her children. Steffi, on the other hand, came home to her hubby because she loved him and wanted to be with him for the rest of their lives. Steffi is constantly left wondering when the word no is going to sink into Liam's brain. The bold and the beautiful spoilers. What are Hope Logan and Liam Spencer waiting for? Liam and Hope still haven't unfiled their divorce papers yet indeed though they've been inked for months. If Hope and Liam are so eager to disjoin and move on, why haven't they? Hope is in a married relationship with Thomas, but they cannot move forward without a divorce. Our Hope Steffi and Liam stay believe that reunion. Hope is the right person for Thomas, or that she can give him the love he deserves. Of course, Thomas doesn't agree with her and has no idea that Hope has professed her love for him. Will Steffi betray her family and drive Hope to reunite with Liam? Will Thomas ever forgive Steffi if she makes this be? Be sure to catch up on everything passing with baby right now. Optimistic news and final goodbyes, tune in to find out about all the drama passing in Los Angeles. Sippy Spoilers Daily Update for December 11, 15, 2023 Tease, auspicious news and final farewells. Tune in coming week so you can catch all of the action in Los Angeles. Daily Recap Monday, December 4, 2023 Ridge eventually told Zen to Verity that Eric to go to the dying. sanitarium and Hope assured Brooke after learning of Eric's wishes. Read the entire recap then. Ridge called Thorne while Eric reflected on his life. Steffi, Carter, Hope, Ridge, Katie, and Brooke commiserated over Eric, but they also questioned the need for his party. Eric heated himself, but he wasn't apprehensive that everybody formerly knew his poor health news. Thorne and Bridget arrived at Forrester Creations to reunite with their family and learn the dire news about their potter. Read the entire recap then. Thursday, December 7, 2023, Eric gave Hope and Thomas his blessing while Bridget and Thorne did their stylish to keep it together and latterly, he stumbled at his party. Lie questioned Finn about what he was doing there when he should be by his woman's side at Eric's party. Eric participated emotional moments with his musketeers and family. They ended suddenly when Eric collapsed shortly after learning that he didn't win the contest. At the sanitarium, Finn continued to work on a riddle design. Finn delivers auspicious news to those at Eric's sanitarium bedside. Donna and Steffi fight with Ridge to do the right thing. Ridge allows Donna to say final farewells to her honey bear. The shocking, bold, and beautiful rebuff, nothing's noticed until now. For weeks, word that Eric is dying has spread briskly on the bold and the beautiful then news of fresh donuts in the soaps.com break room. At this point, indeed Zen, whose status as a full, fledged Forrester grandson was forgotten for a while there, is in the know, but one crucial character remains in the dark. Inexplicably so. Why on Taylor. earth has no Brooke is right there in the thick of effects despite the fact that she cheated on Eric with his son Ridge and went on to connections with his other son Thorn and nearly grandson Thomas to Bobble. But Taylor nowhere in sight. And okay, fine, she was involved with not only Eric but Ridge and Thorn as well. 
Okay, and Eric's Maya son, Rick. Shouldn't Steffi and have... Or Thomas have given Mama a heads up that Eric was on his last legs. Wouldn't they prefer to cry on Taylor's shoulder than step dearest Brooks? And indeed, if they wouldn't rather have Taylor to turn to, wouldn't Taylor want to make herself it makes available about for as them important to sense as Rick, Kristen, and Felicia all being on safari at the very moment that Eric's farewell party had to be thrown? Perhaps the show is pulling a fast bone on us. Perhaps Taylor really does know that Eric is ringing the bell at Heaven's Gate and is using her history as an oncologist. Flashback that from way back when. Hmm. To whip him up a phenomenon cure. Or perhaps she snuck off to Morocco to have old honey prince Omar conduct the secrets of the magical life, sustaining ways he used to keep her out of the grave. Doubly, Finn has hope during a veritably dark time as Finn, right? Is there a way to save Eric beautiful Forrester. spoilers for Monday? December 11, 2023. Promise Ridge is put in a terrible position as Finn tries to make everything more. Bold and the beautiful spoilers highlights Eric is in the sanitarium and the end is veritably, veritably near. His family, musketeers, and the woman who loves him are each in a fear as they sweat he's knocking on death's door. Is there a way to save him? A ray of hope Finn thinks he has some answers. He doesn't have a cure yet, but he has faith one is out there. He delivers the auspicious news at Eric's bedside and prays it's enough to get the ball rolling. However, will Eric take the threat? He made it clear he didn't want to be rehabilitated or have months of treatment. If Finn is right and there's a path to recovery, heck, he didn't indeed want to follow his croaker's advice. Will Finn that change now, made at the same time? Ridge has the daunting task of making some life, altering opinions, this is the most delicate time of Ridge's life, and he's not sure what the right answer is. All he knows is he loves his pattern and will do whatever is right for Eric. Will the rest of the family agree with his choices? It's not like they're in the catbird seat, laden with this responsibility. This is all on Ridge's shoulders. Hopefully, Brooke will be there to help the man she loves during this unbelievable time. In case you missed it, Mornings on Soap Pub are for commentary or wild enterprise about the bold and the beautiful's current stories where they're going, how they're doing, and occasionally just what we're hoping we will see in the near future in Los Angeles. We're particularly fond of this one, so please click then to read it. The Bold and the Beautiful Charade Dr. Weekdays Johnson on Finnegan CBS. on The Bold of the Beautiful is a newer character, so fans were naturally curious as his past was revealed bit by bit. Of course, viewers probably recognized his portrayer, Tanner Novlin, from his very popular Liberty Mutual commercials where he plays a struggling actor who is really struggling with his dialogue for the ad. Also, Novlin is married to former Baby D star Kayla Ewell in real life. Novlin made his daytime debut in July 2020, and while it appeared that his run came to an end in April 2022 when Finn met a tragic fate, that was all misdirection on the soap's part to keep the audience Bill Spencer's guessing. car while out on a motorcycle ride. Steffi Forrester landed herself in the hospital where the handsome younger Dr. John Finnegan ran some tests and informed a worried Bill that she was stable. As Steffi's visitors came and went and brought some drama with them, Finn focused his attention on his patient. And after Steffi was discharged, he stopped by her home to reveal that he lived nearby and thought he'd drop off her paperwork in person.